Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's awesome that you're tuning in. So in this video, I wanted to show you how you need to basically like activate Bodice Hera on your Win 600 from Embernic and what you need to do for it. But first thing, how do we connect it? Well, this is not a tutorial how you need to set up a Bodice Hera drive. So for example, I got this one. This is just a hard drive. Take consideration if you're going to use this, it will consume more energy from your battery. So your lifespan is going to be less. Another option, and maybe more convenient is a very tiny thumb drive only downside to these things are they can get really hot over time you also have like a long one with better cooling but again there are choices to, to be made at the top we will find a usb drive and very fast port very happy they did this you can just plug in your device like this and let's show you how you need to boot it up and get into the usb thumb drive in this video i just wanted to show just the hard drive so let's plug it in and let's power it on when powered on, you will see the LED goes on. The next thing you need to do, press the volume down. Here you can see you're going to get yourself the boot menu. I have seen this problem before. I think it's a problem with the hard drive. I don't know if the thumb drive will have the same issue, but sometimes it doesn't recognize it the first time. So the hard drive has been spinned on. I think it was a little bit too late. So let's turn it off. Let's turn it back on. And let's do the same thing. Hold the volume down. Let's hold it. Now you can see it shows the USB 3.1 and that's basically the one that we need. Next thing that you need to do, switch this to mouse mode and we can navigate to the bottom part and activate the bottom zero image pressing A. And now it will boot up. When the system has been booted up, you can see like the display is not showing the image correctly. So the next thing that we need to do is putting it back in joystick mode over here. So then we're going to press start if your joystick has been configured correctly. And the next thing we need to do is going to the system settings. Take consideration only from what I understand of Bodice Hero 33 and 34 and so on have this option. All right, press B, depending on how you configured your controls. Here we need to go to the rotation mode. It will be located in here. Here you can see screen rotation, press 90 degrees and go back. You need to have like a quick reboot. All right, so not everybody will maybe have this problem, but also show you how you need to fix this. It's a little bit of an annoying thing. What you need to go, go back to the settings. The thing that I did that worked for me, go to system settings again. Going to the screen rotation, going to put it on 270 degrees. Yep. So basically it's going to be upside down. But I've noticed when doing this, it shows the correct image or better said in the correct way how it should be. Okay, next, let, next up we're going to the system settings again. Now we're going to do it upside down. If you have some troubles like me, we need to locate the screen. We're going to put it back in 90, select it again. And if you're lucky, it's going to be setting it up in the right format, what you can see over here. So this is basically how you need to do it. I hope this video helped out. I want to thank you for watching. Consider subscribing. If you have any problems, you can always leave it in the comments and maybe somebody, me or somebody can help you out. And it will be great to see you in the next video.